Uh, they call me the miracle man. They, I, I really wasn't expected to survive. Roger Webb is a fighter. When I um, first found out, I was, you know, I was ready to try and escape from the hospital, but they weren't going to let that happen because I couldn't walk anyway. He says he's recovering from West Nile virus and the coma it put him in. First thing I said when I when I woke up, I said, "Where's the dog?" His dog Bella. The two-year-old pug that's always on his mind. She uh, is terribly spoiled because she sleeps with me. But Webb says he hasn't seen Bella in months. More or less devastating. He says when boarding Bella got to be too expensive for his family, they told him they turned to Pug Rescue of San Diego for help fostering the dog until Webb got better. You grieve just like you would for a... Uh, for, uh, uh, a, a member of your family because she has family. Webb says instead of keeping her safe for him, the rescue adopted his dog out to a new family. Although she may be cared for, she's not, she's not with me. Late this afternoon, we reached an attorney for San Diego County Pug Rescue after placing several calls to the group. She wouldn't comment on the specific claims Webb is making. She would only tell us the group does not now and has never provided temporary foster care. According to their website, all their pugs come from private homes or shelters, and the group only accepts pugs from their legal owners. Webb says he has started a petition to get Bella back since he claims the rescue isn't returning his calls. The dog was supposed to be fostered, not adopted. He's vowed to keep up his battle for Bella while fighting for his own recovery. I won't rest until I get her back. Bree Steffen, 10 News.